Saturday and welcome back to the vlog. Oh my god, we're here. It has been almost two weeks since I stopped vlogging. It's been today's the 13th day since I put down the camera and I am back and I don't know what to report for my time off. So my initial thought was if I'm not vlogging, I'm going to immediately fix my sleep schedule and the world's going to be a glorious place and that was very much not the case. I stopped vlogging and slept for eight hours the next day, I think, and then still had to nap, and then slept for like seven hours and still had to nap, and I was like, am I dying? <laughs> um, but I think it was one, just like so long of not getting enough sleep, and two, I think it has to do with my allergies because I have to take allergy medicine pretty regularly, and um, so I think it's partially allergies of why I'm really tired often, but I did a lot of stuff in those almost two weeks while I was away. I tried to fix my sleep schedule by reading before bed instead, and that actually worked really well for about two days until I was just so obsessed. I was rereading Death Note, the manga, and <laughs> then I was staying up too late to read, so that was a problem. I did a lot of embroidery. I think I finished like five pieces, which was nice. Just been chilling. I watched quite a few shows. I I think I'd watch Bridgerton. I think I watched it again. I finished watching Younger. I can't remember if I finished that before. I started watching The Great, which is hilarious. It's like Catherine the Great's rise to fame or like whatever to power, but it's like an occasionally true story, so it's pretty funny. And I worked a lot, and um, that's about it. So it, it's, yeah, I don't think the two weeks were what I thought it was gonna be, but it was definitely needed in any case. And also I have decided to revise my vlogging schedule. I did talk about this beforehand. So currently I have video game videos going up on Tuesday and Thursday. Those didn't stop while I was away. And then I need to check, I wrote it down. I need to check because I can't remember what I decided. So I need to find it. Okay, so vlogging henceforth, gonna be three day vlogs. And then one day I won't vlog at all. So Saturday, Sunday, Monday, I will film. <laughs> Tuesday I will edit that vlog and Wednesday it will be live and then the second vlog will run from Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. <laughs> I will edit that on Friday and I will upload it for Saturday. So I feel like that's gonna be a lot more manageable because the one thing that I definitely learned in this time off was that daily vlogging takes up a lot of my time. Like I'd be like okay I want to get this thing done. I'd be like okay I need to set up shots for that <laughs> and when I wasn't doing that, I found that I was more productive and also when I wasn't editing every day. So hopefully this works. <laughs> That's the plan anyways. And um, there'll probably be some like growing pains while we get there together, but hey, that's all right. But that is the current plan. So sounds like vlogs are gonna be Wednesday and Saturday. And um, yeah, hopefully I don't burn out and do that whole situation again because there are things that I would like to do and get done that I just feel like I can't do because of the daily vlogs. That's what I feel, like sleep, that's a thing. So we will see, fingers crossed that this works out. Um, and if not, we will adjust it. But yeah, I'm back 
It is quarter to one on Saturday. It is snowing outside. It's been snowing since like 10 o'clock last night. And I believe my mom and I are going to go grocery shopping later. She's just at work right now. And um, yeah, that's, that's where we're at. Nothing exciting, truly and really. But here we are. We are back. Alrighty, we are back in the kitchen. Very exciting. Hello. <laughs> so... Last night we had a very lazy night when it came to food and I ordered in KFC. My mom worked later so they had pizza and now I think I'm going to reheat some of this KFC. Do I want to do fries with it too? No, I think I'm just going to reheat some of this popcorn chicken. Very exciting. <laughs> and then um, have that for a quick snack. It's currently like 1.30. I haven't really eaten anything today. I had a breakfast drink, but should I just do them all? I won't eat them all. Um, so I'm just gonna have a snack and then I think my mom should be home and then we're gonna go grocery shopping after that. But yeah, this is what my exciting day is looking like. It's actually nice because the way I've set up my vlogs now, let's turn so we have better lighting is my first day of vlogging should always be a day off, which is nice. Oh, <laughs> my mom's boyfriend definitely left his phone here. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> he went out to do some Valentine's Day shopping for my mumsy. Um, so yeah, but anyways, the way I've set up my vlogs should be, I typically don't work Saturdays or Tuesdays anymore. So that should be good. Like, I should always be able to start from home. It's still coming down quite a bit. Like, I would say we've probably got close to six inches of snow. This, this doesn't like to focus out there very well because of the brightness, but, like, that looks like close to six inches, which is really quite insane, and it's also supposed to snow until, like, um... My goodness. It's supposed to snow until Monday. It's only Saturday. It's so nice. I'm not going to show you because that will definitely show where I live. So... That's what we're up to, that's what we're doing. I'm just mostly gonna have a chill day, I think. Um, there are things I wanna do, um, but nothing like super pressing. So yeah, that's where we're at. I'm gonna, I think I might make fries too, honestly. Just bump that up to 450 with a little handful of fries and um, go from there. Alrighty, well, I am back home now. I did terrible. I brought my camera to vlog while shopping, but it's just so hard to shop. It's like there's extra challenges when you're shopping in the midst of a pandemic. And so I just like, okay, let's get our stuff and let's get out. And we also had our groceries and we had groceries for my grandma. So <laughs> yeah, I forgot. But anyways, we went out to my grandma's house. It was beautiful and snowy up there. I mean, it's beautiful and snowy here, but she's got pretty trees and um, dropped off her stuff. I also got some snacks for me. Got some Kool-Aid jammers because I'm a child. Easy Mac, allergy medicine. That's some Valentine's Day stuff from my mom's boyfriend from my mom. And um, I think it's just gonna be a chill night so far. I'm almost done. Well, I'm done a lot of stuff on my list. I'm trying to decide if I wanna do laundry or not because while there is snow currently, it's just gonna get worse. It's supposed to snow through Monday. So like, I don't know, do I do it today? Do I do it tomorrow? It's not like a huge rush, but also it'd be nice to get it done. It'd be nice to get it done. So I don't know. Anyways, I think for now, I'm just gonna tidy up a little bit. Oh. So like one of my biggest pet peeves is wet socks. I hate it when like you're getting ready to go out the door or whatever, or you step somewhere where somebody with wet shoes has stepped. Cause like, why are you wearing your shoes inside? Don't wear your shoes inside. So. This morning I got ready and I knew we were going out to go shopping. So I put on two pairs of socks because I know I was going to be wearing my snow boots and they're a little bit thinner. And, or they're, yeah, they need like a thicker sock. So I was like, perfect, we're good. So I go downstairs and as I, I'm, I step down in front of the closet, open the closet to pull out my snow boots. And then I'm like, my foot's wet. And my mom was like, oh yeah, my boots are a pain to put on. And so I didn't want to take them off. So I've just been walking around with them on. And I'm like, I'm so glad 
that you're not inconvenienced and you don't have to take your shoes off and put them on. But now I have to go all the way back upstairs. I gotta take off these socks. I have to find new socks. I have to put them on. But glad you didn't have to take off yours. I was so annoyed. So yeah, that's why I have like perfectly clean otherwise socks there, but they got wet and then I couldn't wear them. So, because I can't stand that. <sighs> but that's where we're at. I'm gonna tidy up a little bit and then maybe do some work on the computer and like organize the snacks and stuff. But yeah, and it is currently like, five o'clock. It's been like, a, I slept for a long time last night. It's been a long day, but a short day. But anyways, let's get some stuff done. I got a confession. Been losing all momentum. But just because it's easy. But that don't make it better. better, better. I want to take my hands deep down in the dirt. Take a walk along the street if I'm feeling dessert. Alrighty, well, it is quarter after 10 and I just watched a lovely two hour lecture on computer science. I decided to start auditing a computer science class while I was taking my break, but honestly, it's only the second lecture that I just got to because, uh, one, they're long and two, I've just been so tired. But fingers crossed, <laughs> we're getting better. Tomorrow, maybe I'll work on the problem sets and the labs and stuff, but I got through it and it wasn't as painful as the first one. The first one, it was slightly shorter than two hours. This one was just over two hours and it took me two days to watch the whole thing, but it was like probably a four to five day ordeal. So fingers crossed this is better. I'm looking like overly red right now. I don't know. Anyways, like I said, it is a quarter after 10. I am picking up Battle Royale to read because this is the book that I started reading. I started reading it last night. I think I got like 80 pages into it because it, this is a reread, but it's a good book. Kind of like with Death Note, reread, but good. So I'm going to read, I'm going to change, get ready for bed, climb into bed and read for a bit. And then tomorrow we will do the things that we want to do slash didn't do today. I want to do some writing tomorrow, hopefully, but we'll see how that goes. Also, I was going to move my air purifier and my sewing machines tomorrow, but I did that today. So if you remember, the air purifier was sitting here. It's now like crammed about there in my closet. And I don't know if you can see, you can just see the edge of my sewing machine there. And there's no longer a sewing machine there. So basically I want to move my sewing machine that I typically use into a more secure, less dusty place. So I put that in the toy box that I have right there. And then I moved the sewing machine that was in the toy box, which if you remember broke, like the, the display will no longer display. Um, I moved that there underneath. I think eventually I'll make a cover for it or just cover it up with something so it doesn't get dusty, but it's there for now. I'm like, should I try to sell this and be like, great deal? Because while all the different things work, you have to guess <laughs> to get to it. So I don't know, we'll see. Anyways, did that today. So feeling good because it's been on my list for a while. And yeah, now I'm going to change my PJs, get ready for bed, and um, I will see you tomorrow. <laughs> good night. Good morning, good morning. Boy, is the snow coming down a lot more than yesterday. Yesterday, it was kind of like smallish flakes, just kind of chilling. Today, they're like wooing, and they're a lot bigger. So that's fun. Anyways, it is currently 10.30. I just woke up like... 10-ish. I set an alarm for 9.30, but I noped because <laughs> I just don't want to get up. I had some weird dreams last night. I blame the reading that I've been doing recently because I find when I read a lot more, my brain goes woo a lot more. So yeah, that's, that's what's up. I think I'm just going to wake up. I've got a breakfast drink here. I got a new container. Look at that. Because my mom's boyfriend often does the dishes and I try to wash my glass containers that I have, but he's like, I hate them so much. So I'm trying this out to see if it's better. <laughs> so we'll see because like the one thing that sucks about that is I only have one of those and I'm notoriously bad for piling them up in my room. <laughs> so this forces me to have to clean it. So we'll see. Anyways, I'm just gonna spend a little time Huh. Anyways, I'm just gonna spend a little bit of time waking up, probably watch a couple YouTube videos, and then see what I have on the list for today.
Well, hello again. I've been having a very lazy day since I picked up the camera last. All I've done of consequence <laughs> or like, well, I guess, you know, know what? You know what? I made my bed and I tidied my room. I was gonna say all I've done is transfer yesterday's footage, but I did that too. So that's exciting. But mostly I've just been watching YouTube. I found a couple new channels to subscribe to in my break. I just can't. One is a girl who just bought a hundred year old cottage in Texas. Um, I think her name is, her username is XO McKenna. Um, and she's renovating it. I'm like, I'm super into that. And then I found this one. What's this channel called? Michelle and Aileen. And they have just moved back to New York after leaving New York because of the pandemic. So yeah, I'm enjoying them. So <laughs> that's what I've been doing all morning is just catching up on YouTube. But I think what I'm going to do now is, and you see all these cubes here, I have too many pajamas, for one. <laughs> there's more there, and I think there might be more, oh yeah, there's some more in my sock cube here. <laughs> Among the other issues down there, which there's things I don't need up here, like I'm pretty sure I have a food processor in here. <laughs> yeah, a food processor, and this is like kitchen stuff. <laughs> So I think I'm gonna spend a little bit of time organizing and going through that stuff, getting rid of pajamas. Cause like the thing is, is I wear like four or five different sets of pajamas and that's it. And I probably have like 20 pajama pants. So I'm gonna go through now, hopefully get rid of some stuff and then feel better about that. And then hopefully later today too, kind of same situation in the closet. I have a lot of clothes I don't wear and I just keep keeping them cause I'm like, maybe in the future I will wear these and then I just don't wear them. So that's part of the plan for today. I also want to work on some computer science stuff and do some writing hopefully. So fingers crossed, <laughs> this all goes to plan, but I'm just gonna keep watching this and um, start doing that. <laughs> Windows wide, the curtains fly to catch the evening breeze. Without you here to keep me warm, believe I'd rather Believe I'd rather freeze. How long can we walk that line between the sea and sand? How long can we bide our time for dreams we never planned? Alrighty, so I spent some time going through the cubes. I think I organized about half of them. I didn't get rid of as much stuff as I would hope would have hoped, but it's fine. I have like, that's all my winter stuff. So I'm not gonna get rid of that. I went through that one recently. I used to make um, duct tape wallets and purses and stuff. And so that's full of duct tape. Um, I organized this one a little bit <laughs> and I don't, even, I don't even know what's in there. So anyways, we made some progress. I also washed my masks. <laughs> because I was behind on that. I'm normally really good and I wash my mask immediately when I get home after I use it, but I've just been getting a little bit lazy. So those are drying now. <laughs> and I stopped and I had lunch. So I think what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna switch to a little bit of computer work. I didn't have edit a video game video on my list, but I think I should be able to get one done pretty quickly here. I am so orange because of the lighting. Yeah, it's fine. Um, <laughs> So I think that's the plan and then maybe do some writing and then maybe get into the the computer science lab thing and then later tonight the closet. Oh, I have to do invoicing today too. That is not on my list. I'm going to write that on my list right now. And um, yeah, just try to try to get some stuff done. Lost track of the forest through the trees, forgot what I was chasing. Been so many nights living out at sea that my heart is gone vacant. And everybody who was close to me all stayed on dry land. So now I'm driving back on in the state west. I just gotta feel something. Not gonna wait till the morning because something's gonna change my mind. I don't wanna change my mind. I wanna stay right here, right here Chilling with my friends for another year I would walk away from the spotlight I am honestly feeling ready for a nap now. It is currently quarter to five. I managed to edit the video that I wasn't gonna edit, but it's edited now. 
do invoicing, which only took me like seven minutes, so <laughs> that was nice, and write out two of my character DNAs for some secondary characters things. They're actually both organizations this time in my story that I'm working on, which is very exciting. I kind of went through like some of the stuff that I've written before on it, and I was like, it's kind of freaky how, um, because this story has like a plague in it. <laughs> And there's a reason I didn't work on it last year. I'm just saying. Anyway, it's interesting. It's just interesting. Uh, so I don't have too much left on my list. Just getting into my closet, maybe. I think, I think my masks are dry enough that I can relocate them now. And then uh, working on some computer science lab stuff. We'll we'll check into that later. But I think I might just like chill, have a little lay down, and maybe read for a bit. Because, like I mentioned, I've been trying to read more. And I am currently reading Battle Royale, and honestly, I haven't read it for a while. I, th I think I've read it twice. I think it's my third time reading it. I read Hunger Games before I read this, and I'm very glad that I read Hunger Games before I read this because this book is so much better. And also Hunger Games, which came out m much later than... Battle Royale seems like a complete ripoff of this. I know sh the author has said that she never even heard of Battle Royale, but it's like the similarities are just crazy. But anyways, what I'm saying is if you haven't read Battle Royale, you definitely need to read Battle Royale. That's where I'm at. But yeah, I think I'm going to chill for a bit and maybe read until it's dinner time and then we'll get into the relocating the masks and maybe getting into the closet and then computer science stuff later. I think that's a good plan, but I've had a super productive day, which is fantastic. Alrighty, so it is just before 10. I've been trying my best lately to climb into bed between like 10 and 10.30, mostly because I want to read. I think I'm like halfway through. I started it like two days ago. It's a really good book, honestly. Again, I seriously suggest reading it if you've read Hunger Games or if you thought about reading, reading Hunger Games or if you just like a good book. It's a good book. <laughs> Anyways, um, I did a face mask. My face feels all nice and just moisturized. And then I did some of the computer science problem sets, but I was having some issues with the functionality of the site. I don't know if it's because I'm just auditing the course or if there's different reasons, so... I kind of gave up on that and just chilled, but tomorrow's another day. Hopefully I can be just as productive tomorrow, if not more productive. Would love to get laundry done, but snow. <laughs> it stopped snowing now, but I'm pretty sure nothing's shoveled on the way to the laundry room, so that'd be a pain, and it's also supposed to snow overnight, so we'll see. But anyways, <laughs> I'm gonna go to sleep now. Probably gonna sleep in tomorrow because we're just doing it, and so I will see you tomorrow when I wake up. <laughs> Good night. Good afternoon. It is just afternoon. I've just been awake and chilling and I'm still in my PJs and I haven't done much other than watch some YouTube videos, but you know what? It's a stat today, which means no worky for me. <laughs> it actually got sunny too. You can see the sun shining on my bed and it's not snowing. It was supposed to snow for like, I think it was supposed to be rainy last night and then snow for another couple days, but now it looks like it's done snowing. It's going to be nice tomorrow and the next day and then it's going to pour rain and then maybe next Wednesday it might snow. So that's kind of nice. Although I still like, I want to do my laundry, but they haven't cleared the paths in our complex for that, nor have they plowed the road. So I can't even walk down like the parking lot road. So I don't know. We'll see. It's not like desperate, <laughs> but it'd be nice to be able to do my laundry. So we'll see, we'll see how ambitious I feel later in the day. Honestly, right now I am super not ambitious at all, to be honest. I've got a decent list of things I would like to get done today, but we'll see. <laughs> in any case, at some point I should like, you know, change out of my PJs, just come with PJs on and um, make my bed and all that fun stuff and maybe eat some lunch, I don't know, we'll see, but you know, it's gonna be a slow day, I think, and that's totally okay. Running through the last of my thoughts, standing on the edge of my chance. Everything I know will be gone in a minute, and that's all right. Running through the last of my thoughts. Everything I know 
Alrighty, so it has been a couple hours. It is currently 20 after three and I left the house for a bit because my mom had some errands to run and I was like, me too, I'll go too. So important things in turning my room into like a kid's snack haven. I now have the Easy Mac and these knockoff brand. Let's see if I can get a good shot of this. The Walmart brand Pringles. Oh my God, they're so much cheaper than the regular Pringles and they're so good. So now my snack selection is complete up here. I also have to rinse this out after this morning, but it's fine. And then we're not done. <laughs> I have now filled my fridge like a child. I've got Sunny D <laughs> and Kool-Aid. <laughs> oh, and there's some cheese strings here too. <laughs> and then face masks, naturally. I just wanted more options in my room. Anyways, there were a few other things that I did pick up while we were out too. I got some more socks because I think I've been losing some in the washer and stuff. They're not exactly the same as the socks I had color-wise, but they're the same socks. Those I mostly wear for work. I also got these plain black sweatpants, which are pretty thin, which is what I was looking for to wear um, at work and just chilling about and they're 15 bucks, which is nice. I also picked up these two satin pillowcases because it's been annoying me that I have one satin pillowcase and one not satin pillowcase. So I just want to match them up and hopefully those will be good. That one's also getting super grungy. So fingers crossed it'll be good. And then I got a thing I didn't need to get. Did I need to get anything? No. Oh, colorista semi-permanent hair color. I couldn't decide if I wanted to go like this teal color or this pink color. So I don't know. I'm going to do it like, like this, I think, like on the tips, not the whole head. So that's very exciting. I just need to decide when I'm going to do it. So I'm going to read the instructions and figure that out. I definitely need to shower today. So like if it should be done on clean hair, then I can shower and then do it later. So I don't know. Anyways, that's where we're at. I did some writing earlier, as you saw. I think I might do more writing. And also I think I've I've been thinking about the computer science thing with the labs and stuff. I think what I might do is I might watch a couple more of the classes and see if I like it. So far, I'm like, this is really interesting, but see if I like it. And if I do like it, then maybe what I'll do is instead of auditing, I'll actually take the class. So I don't know, currently, undecided on that and also I'm like if I'm gonna ramp up writing I need to, that's gonna be a lot of time that I need to focus on that so that's where we're at that's where we're figuring out I think I'm gonna read the instructions on this and then maybe jump in the shower because I'm feeling kind of gross because we're you know in stores and stuff when you have your mask on it's like <sighs> can't breathe because you get all hot and then yeah oh and then we went to A&W for lunch on the way home which was a super late lunch but it was so good onion rings oh, so good anyways that's where we're at. I'm gonna read the instructions, chill, and then maybe jump in the shower and um, see how the rest of the day goes. I'm not gonna lie, I've been being very lazy. I showered, I washed my hair, and I have some pink in there. I don't know if you can see, I guess it's maroon. Um, and I'm just waiting until I can rinse it out, which is pretty much right now. Uh, wow, somebody's being aggressively loud outside with their vehicle. Anyways, <laughs> in exciting news, I did manage to get all my video game videos edited for the rest of the month. So I don't have to worry about anything for the rest of February, which is fantastic. Everything's uploaded. That is great. And then I think, I don't think I'm gonna do my laundry today, mostly cause I'm super lazy. But like I said, I think I might do some more writing, but first I'm gonna rinse this out, see how it looks. And then I'll, um, I'll let you know. Alrighty, well, it is currently 7.20. I just finished dinner and I'm just like not feeling it. Also, you can see the pink a little bit. I'll try to show you better tomorrow. Um, but I'm just gonna climb into bed with my book and read for a bit and maybe have an early night because I'm just like, I'm just tired and I'm just not feeling it. So with that, I'm gonna end the vlog here. Thanks so much for coming along on these last three days and bearing with me as I figure out what the heck I'm doing with this new schedule. And I will see you tomorrow morning. I guess technically I will see you Saturday for the next vlog. That is correct. <laughs> Good night.